All right, so we're back. It's been a while since we uploaded a video, and now we're checking out the awesome brand new RS3 for 2022. And this is one aggressive looking car. So glad to finally see this in person. This one's got the head up display on this model, big drilled rotors. This thing is mean, mean, mean looking car. I love what they've done with the design. And it's a sharp looking car. Got the nice sequential turn signals there, all blacked out rings and emblems, and the R specific oval exhaust uh, outlets. Pretty cool diffuser. Got the BO sound system, the high mounted brake light, keyless entry, awesome looking vents here on the quarter panel here, the front quarter panel. Functional as you can see. Really good uh, satin black. Really cool kind of matte finish on this wheel. Something new that I haven't seen on Pirelli tires. Got some really cool DRLs and the turn signals. That's nice honeycomb design on the grill. Checking out the interior. This is where this uh, platform in this generation car has really changed compared to the previous iteration. But you can see it's a really modern design, very futuristic and scientific design. Got the cool uh, virtual cockpit on this particular model. Some suede materials with ambient lighting options, you know, like we talked about. And once again, you got that nice uh, quilted stitched leather, the sport bucket seats. Very clean, uncluttered design, very driver focused, and that's the neat thing about it. And I think it's a home run in terms of design and how much fun you can have behind the wheel. Uh, the wheelbase has gone a little bit longer than versed, uh, the previous gen, and the seats are pretty far back. So this is not really an indication of the room that you have. You have the third zone climate as well. Just a sweet looking car, a beautiful stance. Just a sweet car overall. So once again, the RS3, got the five cylinder with 401 horsepower. And the torque has been bumped up by 15 over the previous gen as well. Gear is a little more aggressive. So your performance has definitely picked up quite a bit on this model. And the magic is definitely at the rear end with the new drive system providing the power there. So it's a really cool car. So thanks for tuning in. And I uh, hope you enjoy the video. Please share, subscribe, and like. We'll catch you later.